Go ahead and got it. So the restaurants, if we'd send this to like American Bounty or whatever, they would get it, head it and got it. Because we're gonna take the heads and the guts out, okay? So always look for the squishy side. Again, the hard side where the flesh is, all right? If you're doing a little flounder, winter flounder like this. Oh, look at these guys. What eye is it? Right or left eye? Right. right. No, what eye is it? Left. Well, huh, what's it called? Yeah. Right, right eye. Just because yeah. I turn it one way doesn't mean like, oh, now what eye is it? Well, I you were saying like Left eye. Yeah. Oh, now what eye is it? <laughs> right eye. No. Always find the belly. Put the belly down. No animal ever has their belly above their head. Okay? It's not how it works. Yeah. Right? So you feel it where the belly is? It's right eye. This guy. Feel where the belly is? Left eye. Left eye. All right? Swim the fish toward, if you're right-handed, you want the belly away from it, all right? If you're left-handed, then you're gonna cut the fish this way, all right? From here. When you take your knife, what fin is this? Pictorial fin, okay. If you take your knife and come straight down this way, look, you're leaving probably three, four, five ounces of meat right there on the fish, okay? So you have to come at the angle right by the gill plate, Here's the gill plate, right around here, you see this? As close to that as you can. Knife straight down in, all right? Come down. And this guy's hard. If you need to, on a big fish like this, you can go over and grab a mallet, a rubber mallet, and you hit your knife down to get it through, because it's really hard to get through. These guys are lots easier, okay? Belly side, just because this is a right-eyed fish, you actually have the pigment, the head swimming toward you, but the pigment side up, all right, okay? Knife down. Yeah, see? That one's easy to get off. This one, not so much. So make sure you get all the way down through it. Simple. Now, pull the head, twist it, and out come the guts. Okay? Just like that. Simply, turn out to throw it on the floor. You'll have a gold tin set up. We go right in the gold tin, same thing with this one. Pull the head, twist it, pull the guts out, okay? Reach in, pull it out. What is this right here? The row. The row can stay in it, all right? The row won't cause belly burn. Why do we take the guts out? Prevent belly burn. Prevent belly burn. What will belly burn do to the flesh of the fish? Destroy it. Yeah, it'll turn yellow. It'll discolor it, it'll make it mushy, it'll cause the fish to rot from the inside out. Is that because much. of the acidity level yeah. or, or? Yeah, it's because of the enzymes that are in it. So you think about the enzymes in our stomach, the acid, the enzymes, it probably is a little bit of acid. I'm not sure as much of it's acid as it is the enzymes that are actually in their belly that break down the food. It's going to break down their flesh. It's going to start eating through and breaking down the flesh, the enzymes will. Acid probably plays a part of it. I don't know how much though, honestly. So, questions about gutting the fish. Yeah, Jim? Do you have shrimp in house? Maybe a pound? Yeah, like a pound. Maybe? I don't know. Can I have a pound going out? So, questions about gutting round, uh, flat fish. So, if the fish is right eye, pigment side up, if you're right handed, right in behind the pectoral fin, come down, twist, pull it. It's a left eyed fish, and you're right handed, right in behind, or uh, pigment side down, white side up, down, pull, twist. Okay? Alright, so somebody can gut these other two. We don't need to gut these. The night class will do these. Alright? If uh, one th other thing, too, I'm sorry I didn't mention, make sure you rinse this out. So you see all that. Sometimes you can see there's a little bit of yellow in there already on it. So it's already starting to get a little bit of belly burn. So you want to rinse this out because you can tell the guts kind of get everywhere. So you make sure, always make sure after we gut the fish, take them over, rinse the outsides, rinse the inside out really well. The row can stay in there, put it back on the sheet tray, okay? So these we're going to do right now. Somebody's going to gut the other two of these, and then take them over, get them rinsed. We'll send those out and then we actually need to As for scale a little bit. Yeah, scale a couple of them and we'll send them to American Body. Okay? Yep. Yes,